from the students of Penn State Meteorology. Here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good Friday evening to you. I'm student meteorologist Tyler Hughes with your Campus Weather Service CNET forecast for this evening. And let's start by taking a gorgeous live look over Beaver Stadium right now. Notice beautiful blue skies across the region today. It's been an absolutely gorgeous day today. 68 degrees right now. We're just getting close to 70 degrees, but not quite. And so in our weather headlines, we've been seeing above average temperatures yesterday and today as well. However, that's going to be coming to an end this weekend. We're not talking about a nice weekend, folks. Rainy Saturday, and then by the time we get to Easter Sunday, things cool down dramatically. A blast of winter even on the way for Monday. I know it's hard to think about this time of year, but let's just take a look at the temperatures right now out there. We're running in the mid to upper 60s across the region and when we zoom out to the entire Commonwealth we're not peaking out in 70 anywhere and that's pretty much the story for much of the Northeast as well no big weather systems to be worrying about in the Northeast and that's the good news we're staying in the 60s pretty much everywhere and so it's actually pretty interesting to see how this has affected temperatures as opposed to yesterday. We're pretty consistent across the Commonwealth, so this more has to do with how temperatures were yesterday, but we're more than 14 degrees above where we were yesterday here in State College, but we're 12 degrees below where we were this time yesterday in Philadelphia as well. So that's an interesting little tidbit. And in terms of wind speed, if you've been out there, you may have noticed the winds gusting a little bit. 22 miles per hour was the last gust in State College. It's been gusting more or less in the 20s throughout the day today. And so that'll continue. As we take a look at the future radar, notice as we head into tomorrow morning, though, those raindrops start to work their way into the region. And then as we work into when most of us will be waking up around 9 to 10 or so, notice rain is pretty heavily in the the north and west parts of the state and starting to work its way into Center County as well. Notice in the northwest part of the state though, yes, that's snow starting to work its way through. It'll continue across the northern tier throughout the day on Saturday. We'll have scattered showers here and then as we head through to Saturday night, we have a little bit of clearing, a few clouds around, but notice those snow showers are sticking around and they'll stick around through to Easter morning for much of the region as well. Our shot of winter, however, is going to be coming Monday, and that's with a much larger system making its way through from the west. Notice that mixing situation setting up in State College Monday afternoon. And so whatever type of precipitation we get, Monday will pretty much be a washout for the afternoon. Notice rain to mix to snow across the entire Commonwealth for Monday and then even part of Tuesday morning as well. Tuesday is probably our better chance for getting some wintry mix and even snowflakes here in State College, which it's very late for that climatologically speaking, but certainly possible as well. And then as we head through to Wednesday night, notice things clear out dramatically and we should be looking at a nice rest of your work week. All right, tonight here in State College though, a low of 50 overcast skies, and then as we head into tomorrow, we have the scattered rain showers throughout the day. Certainly nothing like we'll be seeing on Monday with a high of 60. However, those gusty winds are something to keep in mind as well. And Easter Sunday, if you're getting out there for an Easter egg hunt, you might wanna bundle up, put those jackets on, because the, low, the high is gonna be 48, mostly sunny skies, but that's significantly cooler than we've been seeing the past few days. And when we take a look at the seven day, Notice Easter Sunday is our big cool down day and then we're staying in the 40s for much of next week, only peaking out in the 60s again on Thursday of next week. From the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm student meteorologist Tyler Hughes for CNET. Have a wonderful Easter weekend.